We just determined that all energy storage molecules contain a atom that's really important to all life on Earth called carbon. Yesterday, when we were reading about photosynthesis, carbon also came up because carbon in the form of carbon dioxide, along with water, are our two reactants needed for this photosynthesis chemical reaction. And we noted yesterday that photosynthesis only happens inside of plant cells or inside of producer cells in a part called a chloroplast. So let's zoom in a little bit more carefully inside of one of these plant cells in this chloroplast so that we can see more clearly the connection between carbon and carbon dioxide and the carbon in our energy storing molecules. If you have access to the SIM and Amplify Online, go ahead and pause the video right now and use that SIM to watch what happens inside of a chloroplast which is a part of, again, the producer cell where photosynthesis occurs. Then gonna ask that you record your ideas about these three questions. How are the molecules inside the chloroplast different before and after photosynthesis? What does this mean about the process of photosynthesis? And what does this model show about our energy storage molecules and where they come from? If you don't have access to Amplify Online to use the SIM, let's look at it together. So I'm gonna go ahead and open up my SIM. I already have it ready. And if you're accessing the SIM on your own, remember there's this little shortcut here in your stack menu to just jump right to the SIM. If you don't wanna go through that whole click path. Um, so since all we're looking at are producers here, and what's happening inside of the chloroplast during photosynthesis, I'm just gonna press play. And I'm gonna go over here to producers and press view cell. So remember, let's remind ourselves of our questions. We're looking at molecules in the chloroplast before and after, and what this means for photosynthesis. So here's my chloroplast. So there's some molecules. Oh, something just happened. What are you noticing? What's happening right now? What's inside the chloroplast? What just happened? Let's check that out again. So one thing I'm noticing is that I have these purple things up here, which are water, and those square things, which are carbon dioxide, going into my chloroplast. However, what's coming out of the chloroplast are those little circles of oxygen and those orange ones with the black dots, those energy storage molecules. There they are. So that tells me that I only have certain things coming into my chloroplast, that water, that carbon dioxide, just like this image from our reading, those go in, but then they transform through that chemical reaction of photosynthesis to glucose, and oxygen once the process is over. 